Hello there, I hope you're well. I've just done a weekly vegan food trip at Tesco's and it's a big one. It's Friday afternoon and I went and I got a big one. A few new things, a lot of the regular, so I'll go for it all. And it's surprising if you go for a food shop, uh, your perception on what you're going to have to tweet that night changes from one item. Originally I was going to do, um, get a takeaway from Lotus and Zen V Gardens in Gloucester. I love changed my mind and that's Frankie drinking her water in the background because you know what it is. Ian talks to his phone. That's the time to start making noise, isn't it, Frankie? Yeah. Yeah. You don't. She's had plenty of opportunities. Just um, it's what they do for attention. So let's start off on the left hand side and go from left to right. So first of all, baked bean, Irons baked beans. Everyone goes on about Irons baked beans, and I always buy the cheapest beans out there. The Irons baked beans with vegan sausages. Two pound a tin normally. Three tins for four fifty. So I thought I could make go because it'd be ideal for when I go camping, wouldn't they? So I've got them, and I can do a review. And now Dick is drinking water. Sorry about this. I've got myself three pears. I've got myself a big bunch of uh, mint plants for one pound fifty. I've got one onion for twenty one pence, and I've got the chipotle chili paste for one pound eighty. I've got all the Grover's Davis soya drinks and sweetened. They're my go-to at fifty pence each, as always. I've got. Never work with children or animals. You, know, you think I didn't give you more? Don't, please don't. The attire in the background next to you won't. He's a good boy, though. So I've got that. Sorry about that. It's going off tropic as usual. The waffles started early. To be honest, they provoke me by drinking water. Do I never give you water? My right, dicks. Ty's just going for a little walk, which is he's allowed out the cage a little bit at the moment, but he seems to be finding the cage, and that's going off topic completely. I'll do a tie update very quickly. Soon, sorry. Our pro strawberry yogurt for what it's on yellow price thing. Uh, um, 150 at the moment, and it's clearly the um vegan one. I've got four of the plant chef no steak pies, and this is because I bought something else for 265. Never intended on buying those, but I did. I got a Ginx's corn pasty for 125. Got a large jar of gherkins for £1.60. I picked up three of the microwave whole grain rice for 45 pence a packet. I've got a pride lemon juice. I always have this in the fridge. In fact, to be honest with you, I've been using limes. If it's in lemon, I've used lime, but I've got the lemon. Because I'm running low on the lime and I prefer the lemon. That's on offer at 60 pence at the moment. I've got the Bayless and RD Elements Dark Fig, Dark Amber and Fig and Wash. And it's clearly marked vegan. It's for the kitchen. I got two bunch of celery at 75 pence each for 150. You can understand why when I do a video shortly. I got two celery last week, didn't I? I've got the Tesco's finest black grapes, they're still on offer at £1.80. I've got a red cabbage for 80 pence. Two corn on the cob, they are quite small, but they're 139. Two packets of the Ch Tesco's chestnut mushrooms, 89 pence a packet from £1.10. I got a broccoli for 82 pence. I picked up an avocado for 89 pence. And I got the paprika for a pound, just because I've completely run out of paprika the other week and I just needed it for backup. I just need some for the cooking, especially when Jimmy Chili is and what have you. Now, I know I got the old mint plant, but the mint was in the reduced tension there for 18 pence. And I really feel like doing a mint and pea risotto. So, yeah. And I want to make some mint sauce in my view. So I want to try and grow the plant there. But that's to use immediately, basically. And it was reduced to 18 pence. The reason I got it. I got a lovely cabbage for 65 pence. Which I picked up before the thing that caused all the mayhem. And I got some bean sprouts for 59 pence. And I was not I was going to buy the meal deal. But I realised that all the other stuff in the stir fries I've got. So just buy the bean sprouts to bulk out a little bit. 59 pence. Some... I don't ever do, but I did. The Iggy slow roasted tomato broccoli and spinach quiche with basil. Bought it and it's £4.60. No offers on it whatsoever. It was the last one. It's got a few days date on it. I thought, I'm bound to eat it. I'll get it. I got all these small bananas that came to one twenty two. I should really like clock five. I got a bag of coriander from my chilli. Uh, in Kerry's, I love coriander. And that was 52 pence. I've got a bunch of spring onions which have gone up to 69 pence, which you think it's the time of year they wouldn't go up. 
I've got some red chilies again for when I do my chilli, 60 pence. I've got the lamb lettuce and washing and fussy bag on off at the moment at 90 pence, usually one pound 20. I've got a big bag of baby spinach, British baby spinach, it's 166 and I tend to use it and then when it's just gonna to get to its best, past its best I should say, I put it in the freezer and use it in smoothies. I've got a bag of the Wild, Rec blah, 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 Wild Rocket for a pound. And that with the lamb's lettuce, I thought instead of the mixed salad bags and that I buy, I just fancy the mixing up a little bit. So that's where I've done that. Um, this is the reason why everything went kaput. Sliced car Carvo Nero. Love it. It's a real strong taste, isn't it? I thought, get that for a change, even though I bought the cabbage earlier. But it was reduced down to 57 pence and I got two bags of it. But I'm going to steam a load of it up tonight and do it with mashed potatoes. Oh, which is coming up in a minute. And Plant Chef No Steak Pies. I think they're really nice. So I thought, why not treat yourself? All because I bought a yellow sticker I ended up doing that with. But it saved me 15 pounds minimum if I instead of getting a takeaway. I thought Friday night treat yourself, but no, pie, mash and... Carbonero, some organic carrots, so I've got some organic carrots in the fridge, and some nice gravy, which I make. That make a nice change. I know it's a bit warm, but you know what? I don't let the temperature, the, usually let the temperature just dictate what I'm going to eat. And then finally, last but not least, I've got some organic white potatoes. They were £1.60 for one and a half kilo bag, but I thought, you know what? I just fancied them. And if I could boil them up, mash them, but keep the skin on them as well. It's all about the fibre, isn't it? So. Yeah, I did that. So that is my weekly vegan food shop with the never I haven't bought the organic I haven't bought organic takers in donkey's years. So I used to grow my own in my own allotment, so that's what you do. So I'm gonna leave that there. Um yeah, this is a quick scan of it all. You can come to just over fifty pound. And if you add the prices up as we go along, you can get the price. I think about fifty pound. But yeah, um and the receipts in the wallet and I can't be bothered to get it out. I just memorise all the prices. As long as I memorise all the prices, I don't bother getting the receipt out. To be honest with you, unless I'm checking my me, me club card points. But they've just started again. See, I can waffle. I really can. If you've got this far, please give a thumbs up. It really helps the algorithm. It really, really does. Please feel free to leave a comment. I do appreciate them. I know I've been a bit slow here and there at responding, but I'm nearly up to date again. I responded to them all and then a few more come through. Do you know what else? I'm going to have some mint sauce with my pie. I love mint sauce. Sorry. Off topic, you can bleep the A. So, yeah, if you've got this far, thumbs up. Please feel free to leave a comment. If it's something you can get used to, food, I always say food shops, food reviews, mainly 99% of it. Um, food, my meals of the day on, in short form and occasionally dog walks with one long version I did last week. That's the usual gist of it. If you could get used to all that, please subscribe. It'd be amazing. It helps and it'll go if you watch. And if you watch my videos, if you can watch the... Sorry about that. Um, if you're not a prime, if you're not... Blah, 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 whatever you call it, premium member, if you could watch the adverts, because the money's going to fast and that's how we make the money is watching the adverts. And um, there's some... Pretty good adverts at the moment, to be honest. I was checking what the adverts are paid on my videos the other day. And um, yeah, it's a story for a different day. If you got this far, please, at least thumbs up. That'd be amazing. Till the next one, thanks again for watching. Bye.